Hello everyone, welcome back to Snide and Sniff! It's me, Sniff, it's him, Snide. Yeah. We are looking at the art of Vitlut, or Vitlut, I hope I'm pronouncing that right, uh, at Vitlut2 on Twitter. They are a really cool artist, and you can check them out on Twitter or DeviantArt, and you can also get commissions from them. Starting off, we have this adorable little one of Deku and... Acid Girl, I can't remember her name. It's been a while since I read My Hero Academia. Unconventional ship, I I mean, De Deku and Ochako is, is the lawful good ship, but you know, this one isn't bad. Beautiful background here, can I just say to start with? Lovely work on the, the stone wall, but damn, the characters here look so soft. Just out on the stroll, look at all the hands, it's so freaking cute. Yeah, they're probably gonna go to, to go and get some burgers or something. Probably so, yeah. Cutest thing on my timeline right now. Oh heck yes, that's cute. Oh! This is, this is great. The comments aren't even weird. They're just talking about how freaking adorable this is, and I agree. Relationship goals, if you want to be large, I guess. Shout out to the people who want to be thin with large girlfriends, or boyfriends, whatever you want, man. Woman. Individual. And another My Hero one. <laughs> Yo, she... We got a bit more of a bit more of a size difference here. Yeah. Oh my god, he's even like... Like short, he's like he's like tiny. Just looks like they made the booths too big here. He oh, can't, can't even fit himself. It's too like, small. Like this, okay. I know, like you know how I say the they make the booths too small for their customers. You know what? This is almost large enough. This is ridiculously sized. Like for a you know small person like this guy, it's just not built for him. Like he can barely reach the top. He's gonna of have the to table. stand up on his seat. <laughs> My gosh, she is friggin' cute though. He got her one burger. That, like there's only one plate. You got you got you got her one burger. One burger, dude. I hope you're giving her your other burger too. This is not enough for this lady. I mean, you got a big milkshake as well. Such a beautiful mood here. It's so bright and beautifully colored. So the so the, the plugs coming off the ears don't become fatter. Missed opportunity. <laughs> I don't know if I want to see that. I don't know if I want to see that. Early stage relationship goals. Wait, hold on, hold on. Early stage? Wait, which... F for, how big? How big do you want her to get? I've never drawn Ellie before, hehe. <laughs> well, I guess... Fat Last of Us? Guess I there's guess. still food. I, I guess there is food in the apocalypse. Uh, you're, you're the Last of Us guy. I, 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 I play. haven't played 2. This is from 2. Ah, so. this is from 2, of course, yeah. Nice work on the tattoo, though. Honestly, Viet Loot? They have it down. They do. They 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 are very good. Like the shaping and the the lines and the creases and how the fat falls and just it's really good work actually. Keep it up. And from Persona Five, she eats a tiny. What is this? A tiny piece of chocolate or something? And then she just gets big. Great sequence. Always love a sequence. Only thing that would make it better is dialogue. Could we, could we, uh, could we uh, add dialogue and dub it for you, Viet Luda? <laughs> feet aren't that detailed, and I'm fine with that, because frick feet, man. I, I think her face in the last one is so adorable. What is this yeah, This off? looks like Uncharted. Looks like ah, Uncharted, the right. spin-off. Of it does. Look at how flexible this lady is. Oh my god. Can she put her leg behind her head though? That's the ultimate test. But like, wonderful work here. If if you if you know not a, not so much of a fan of the anime look, look Vilu's really good at doing really appealing, uh, like re more realistic sort of faces. It's fantastic. I I just like the mood here. It's just so peaceful. I I'd set this as my like desktop background. This is probably my favorite one, I'm not gonna lie. I'm biased, I'm biased, I'm a Warhammer 40,000 abu, Warhammer 40k nerd, whatever you say, but um, this is just great work, great work with Viet Loot. Was this even a commission? Did Viet Loot just draw this because they're based? Friggin' Fat Tau Commander on a friggin' drone turret? It's attached to the ground, right? I, I love the Viet Loot, because, you know, most of the Tau waifus are like, you know, they really got their helmet off, you can see it's a human-y looking alien lady, but no, they did them with the weird helmet and everything. Feet are right, it's so good! Games Workshop, make a model of this. I will buy it, even though I don't have any Tau. 
Did you miss Gwen? Oh my goodness, wait, they they drew they drew Gwen thin? Incredible! Oh wait, no, there's a second piece. Yes! Thank you! <laughs> oh my god, the new Spider-Verse movie? Yo, that is gonna be so hype. Looks very cool here. Nice texturing, and um, this looks really polished. Like, this almost looks like it'd be like on a friggin' on the freaking comic cover or something like that. It's so good, man. I almost feel like the thin version looks a little, like technically looks a little better than the fat version, but I mean, you know me, I'm not gonna be saying the thin version is better, no way, dog. Those are kind of trendy shoes. They're ruined, no! These two are so adorable. Those sweaters are so cute. I guess they're not big enough though. Well, depends on the look you're going for and they even put a port drawing of cows in the yeah, background that's a, a self portrait up there no. <laughs> i guess <laughs> well that, who knows maybe maybe they're like they spend summer as cows chewing the grass living in this field under the sun because who wouldn't want to do that and then in december they transform into like humans and live inside and have celebrate christmas that sounds like a magical creature you could make up. I want to make that a thing because that's that's how that's that's the life, man. If if you could spend summer as like a cow in like a grassland, as long as you know there's not a, a farmer who's trying to you know sell some sell some spear ribs or anything like that, uh, wouldn't wouldn't you want to do that? And they're eating Santa's cookies. It God looks like. damn. Oh, look, look, if you leave them out and Santa doesn't eat them, you're allowed to eat the cookies. Maybe if this, this is a... Christmas Day, it's fine. Oh my gosh, they have got the present. So maybe Santa was literally like, oh, I, I'm full, I don't need these cookies. And they were like, hey, Santa, Santa, Santa left us the cookies. This is a commission for a better name one. Who's the character? Looks like Yuri Watanabe from Spider-Man. Oh, it looks a little bit like it. Do you a, a floor panel is a, a bit of panel on the flooring is is cracking <laughs> well she's about to discover that it's a secret compartment hiding secret or top secret documents or, or spider-man is hiding there oh <gasps> wait why would spider-man be hiding the floor because it looks like someone from spider-man according to the commenter this is a original character but you subtly noticed all oh, right got it okay now it's not from spider-man <laughs> like, like the way the background's drawn and lighting feed loot your lighting is phenomenal is this a night elf? Wait, no. I think this is actually an Eldar. But this isn't what Eldar look like. They don't have they don't have glowing eyes and and big eyebrows. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong, Vitlud. This is an Eldar, I think. They have all the they have all the Eldar runes on yeah, them. Okay, and everything. Yeah. The bits on her gauntlets look like an Eldar. She has the soul stone. This is clearly like psychic energy. She's in freaking space. Okay, yeah. All right, there. Yeah, that makes sense. Absolute Chad. People don't give enough love to the freaking alien races in uh, Warhammer. Um, and you made the Eldar freaking fat. I, I mean, I don't even know if that like can happen in lore because Eldar are like dark Eldar. I feel could easily become fat. Eldar feels like they'd have like weird rules against being fat, but. I'm not here to debate the friggin' law. I'm and honestly, she looks friggin' terrifying, which is which is right. Like, thick or not, I don't want to get there. This lady with the friggin' lightning crackling out of her fingers, and this wizard lady. This looks more like it's like um World of Warcraft. God, beautiful work on the dress. My gosh, and I mean. Like, Vilu really had to, like, do this, all of these folds of the dress, and then completely differently on the larger one. That's, that's a great work. Oh, man. And they're on a sandy beach or something? Or... I don't like sand. It's coarse and rough and gets everywhere. Not like here. This is really what he was talking about when he was talking about soft and smooth. And, finally, <laughs> Slime Roger. This one is good. Really shiny, this one. Look at that slime. Oh, so cute. This is this is what happens when you when you when you don't set boundaries for your what caramel slimes, and that is all the art we have from Vitlut. Um, yeah, honestly, Vitlut does fantastic art. One fifty thousand fan art, and given love to the Eldar and the Tal, fantastic. Love to see it. Check Vitlut out on Twitter or DeviantArt, whichever you prefer. And um, yeah, commissions are open if you want your own. Go and commission an orc or a friggin' Tyranid or a. a have a good one, y'all. Bye.